keep walking. Which path have you chosen? Every breath is a path. Birth, death, resurrection. That's what we are here for, yes. Within the temple of your body, the music is already happening. Just go in. That's it. But if you go to your so-called saints, you will find them very dry, neurotic people. Don't go to these people. Don't go to the pebble. Go to the jewel. Where is that jewel? Look for the master. But I have looked and didn't find the master. You don't know where you are looking. So you ask God that you don't know. First, when I started feeling that there is something, I was, my body age was 27. And I said, Ya Allah, I'm going to kill myself. I tried once and it didn't work. I don't want this. There is something beyond this. Getting married, having children, divorce, and this and that. When you are ready, the master is ready. The book came. I started reading, I had cancer, terminal case. Okay, cured. Changing the food, changing the mind. What are you here for? Keep walking. And all the doors are open, there is no door. And I lived with the richest and the poorest. I started cooking for them. And look and cook and throw the book. I was cooking for my beloved, not for anybody. And that food had energy. The touch had energy. We are all healers. When someone touched the body of Christ, or he said, who touched me? Thousands of people. And the woman said, I was sick, bleeding, and I touched her. He said, your faith cured you, not me and not God. So where is your faith? Don't be a believer. Trust the trust. Trust existence. Know thyself means know all the climates in you, all possibilities. The murderer, the sinner, the criminal, the saint, the lover. You will see anger cannot be there forever. Sadness cannot be there. Sickness cannot be there. Richness cannot be there forever. So what to do? Just accept it. It's another step on the level. That's all. And then, whenever it is positive, share it. Doesn't mean don't share the negative. Be aware the negative is there because of the positive. So the negative also becomes positive, like yes, yes, no for yes. Yes and no, that's all. You are dancing with it. If you say yes, yes all the time, no, no all the time, yes and no. We will have a new book. Yes, another book. No, or yes and no. There are 300 religions on earth and one truth. And these 300 religions there are thousands of sects and thousands of ways and the new age and whatever. And they are all talking about truth and there is no truth. Talking about peace, there is only war. So, whom to believe? Nobody. Just watch what's going on. Then you will be alone. But in this aloneness, you are the existence. There are people who believe in a hollow earth. Yes, there are people that they say there are people in, within the earth. If it's true, true. If it's not, not. Every smoke, there is a fire. There is no lie. There is truth in everything you say or you speak or you see. Or but don't waste your time with looking for the outside. They are all inside. Truth is inside. 
When you go in, you find it all, not in the body, but in the being. And the key is meditation, 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 meditation. One hour of meditation worth 70 years of worshiping in the mosque or prayer or Quran or whatever. And this is what Muhammad said. He went and meditated and he became enlightened all by himself. He had the seed, he came with the seed. Everybody was waiting with him. He gave signals. But he went for a meditation. You don't need to go to, up to the mountain. Every moment, what are you doing? How are you doing? How are you moving? How are you taking off your shoes? And just then, it becomes your habit, part of life. Yes, let me say that even when the truth is told to you, don't believe in it. Whatever Christ told me, you have to experience the water. Be aware, don't trust anybody, yourself. And then you can share it, but the others, if they are not thirsty, they become followers. I'm not here to follow anybody. Don't come and follow me. Christ said, come follow yourself. I don't want followers. I want fellow travelers, Sahabi, soul friends. This is why then you'll be aware of the truth and the truth never born, never dies. This is why you are here. Don't believe in anybody, in Christ, in Buddha. Trust your own reflection, your own benediction, when you drink it, when you taste it, what I have seen cannot become your experience unless you see it. And what is meditation? Meditation is emptying your mind. When the cup is full, I cannot put water in it. You have to empty your mind and then the existence will give you what you need. So this is why we are here not to do noises, even, you know, be aware of what you are eating, be aware that you are not alone in the room, be aware, don't do any noise. So we are not here now to eat, we are here to listen, we are here to be together in a few minutes, okay? This is not, this is not a place only as a marketplace. If you want to listen, you cannot eat and listen. If you want to see, you cannot walk and see. Be in the moment, at one minute with the one. This is why now this is called Hadra. That's the fragrance, the presence, the existence. We are not in a coffee shop. People, when they ask me to go and they want to have a lecture or whatever, it's not a lecture and the people that are there to eat. I don't go. They pay so much money, please. I said, I am not here, you know, a utility that you can sell and buy me. Respect what you are here for. Otherwise, you become one of these noisy people, one of the crowd. But if you want to be one of the oneness, at one moment with the one, be aware. So the eyes, the ears, they can hear the stillness, the silence, the existence. Many communes are fake. Many masters are fake. Wake up. They only use you. Use your body, use your money, use your mind, that they have people around. No. First, be yourself. Then you know who to go with, what to choose. This is why I'm alone, because it's not easy to find a soulmate. A guest, you are welcome as a guest, but this is not a guest room. This is not a guest house, not lusty. This is a place where you wake up, where you know your real identity, your real divinity. This is why all the people, 
for 50 years, I'm talking in the Arab world. I haven't met any soulmate yet. Very few. Not five out of these trillions and trillions of people. One in Lebanon. He doesn't speak with anybody. He doesn't come to this home when there is another one. Now he's in Paris. I said, Ayub is here. He said, okay, I come. Don't worry, I just, we met before. He was 70 when he saw the sign. And since then, alone. That aloneness is the existence. Otherwise, go to any restaurant and eat or see the dancers or, and enjoy it. Let the body mind enjoy this. You can do it for millions and millions of years. But when you are with the real commune, Arun or whoever are the real, you cannot breathe when they say stop. Hours and days and months. This is how Rumi, Jalal al-Din Rumi, became enlightened, 36 hours. This is how few people, they became enlightened with Micho. He gave the soul, stop. Five days we sit with him, we don't sleep, we don't eat, we don't drink, and that five days, the five elements, they will dance together. But you are with the living Christ, and you are not less than any living light. But you don't respect this. If we respect it, we just be still and listen to it. You cannot ride two horses, or you eat, or you listen. And both of them, you do them, like one Stan Buddha did. And then, this is not it. Another mosquito came. And that mosquito started dancing with him. So if you want to be with the commune, first experience yourself, not your emotion. Watch out, this is emotion. The mind is telling you, you want to be this and you want to be that and you want to be a doctor, you want to do this to help other people. This is bullshit, dead emotion. Don't listen to this. Read and watch out your reading. Any, any page, look at this, any page you read by any real master, every page has a seed. And one seed turns the whole earth green. Every seed is a tree, whatever. The real problem is not consulting the master, but how to be more meditative, because the physical part of the master is not the significant thing. If you are more meditative, you can consult the master every moment. Not the physical presence is not necessary. Just be with the Christ. Don't listen to what Christ is talking. Just be with him, with that energy. The master is ready, if you are ready. And once when you know, met the master and yourself, then you the difference. He is the master. He is the moon and the crescendo. But I am the crescendo. I'm going to be the moon. And when I know the more, then I know that I'm the moon and this and that. And you go beyond your master. Jesus said, you are with me, but beyond me. <laughs>